Hey, mi gente, Ish here at New York Comic Con, and I am here with the insanely talented Luciano Vecchio, o sea, argentino. Gracias por estar con nosotros. Muchas gracias a ti. Okay, so this guy is one of the most phenomenal artists out there right now. No te lo digo porque estás delante de mí, sino que por la verdad. I have his art like on my phone as a screensaver, que se lo mostré. Pero I'm very excited because you have a new project that is near and dear to the Pero Let Me Tell You heart because you created a character that is called El Sereno. <laughs> no, like, I, I'm scared. What, like, what, uh, how did that, uh, guys, you know about El Sereno. What, but in Argentina, El Sereno is lo mismo. Uh, I learned it is in some parts of the country. Like, um, if you go in the, in the country, in the, okay. out of the city, I didn't know that. Uh, in Argentina, Sereno means uh, like El Guardian de la Noche, like uh, the night watchman. Oh. So it's a work. It's a good thing. Yes. Yeah, yes. He's. Uh, yeah, this is a story of a magical boy superhero with powers of light and spirit in a city that is like a futurist utopia by day, mm -hmm. but it becomes a portal of the occult by night. So mm -hmm. he's the guardian of the night. And in Argentina, in, and I think in many places, uh, in, in Espanol, Sereno is uh, the night watchman, and at the same time, it means like serenity, like the, the emotion. So. Not in Cuba, sir, como te está explicando. En Cuba es, es una neblina que acaba con los niños. Like, <laughs> si salen sin, desabrigado, olvídate. Well, no, that, you that, don't recover. That, that will be the Sereno of Tierra 2. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> see, already you got a sequel. Now, can we see the, the, the character? Yeah, can we see the book? This is the, um, the Ashcan exclusive just for this edition of Comic Con. Uh, it's a preview of the first issue that will be solicited next month and will be out in February through CX Publishing. Uh, I did this originally in Spanish in back home in Argentina and this is the first time it gets printed in English. So okay. oh, and he's on your shirt, right? Yes, that's that's uh, that's, that's, that's sitting right there. Before we go, I just want to ask you one thing because what I love about this is that it started in Spanish, now you're translating it, you're from Argentina. How do you think representation of love Latinos in this entire crazy comic book <laughs> industry has has changed in the last couple years because I feel like there's more mm -hmm. um, which is weird because I've always there's always been Latino artists yes. and creators but I think we're seeing more characters do you think that's the case uh, I think so yes um, also the fact that for example this book uh, opened me the door to write for Marvel for the Iceman series Uh, Which is phenomenal, guys. Check it out. Some Marvel Voices stories. And that, for me, a few years ago was unthinkable. Like, if you are not a native English speaker, you don't write comics in the mainstream. Uh, and now, apparently, uh, I, I made it. So <laughs> He did. And you know what, man? Again, you're so talented. Like, you write, you draw. You have managed to change the definition for this Cuban of El Sereno. So thank you for everything that you have done, guy. I mean, honestly, it's phenomenal. Thank you, thank you. Muchas gracias. And I hope you like it when it comes out. Absolutely. Thanks, man.